What's going on guys? I just wanted to come over and give you my candy setup as this is very, very efficient. I've noticed this is probably one of the most efficient ones I've found, but basically it's going to require a ton of candy to actually set up. Um, however, in the end, it's really, really worth it. But basically, um, you're going to want two first lines. Um, I did take out that candy corner finer, uh, so thank you guys for calling that out in the comments. I did not know that you can't use Candy Castle and that together, so I appreciate it. Um, now basically, you're going to want to run two first lines. Uh, one like this, so the ores like spawn inside and then come out. It's goaded as hell. Watch this. Oh. Oh, oh my ore limit's filled. Yep, there we go. So, pretty much, um, yeah, it's it's pretty straightforward. Uh, you just spam these. I personally use the two raised items after the raised ear, so you do that. These four, um, you guys can copy this down if you'd like. And then you do two gumball machines and a super swinite these are all automatic so these are you could just sit here in afk for like 10 minutes come back grab candy um and then your pumpkinite farm is the manual one this is where you're gonna get most of the candy because it's just so extremely quick um that's where you're gonna get pretty much all of this done so this is just kind of a revamped version of the last one i'm gonna go ahead and raise my uh or limit here there we go. Yeah, so it's pretty goaded. Um, let's see how much this gets. This is what I've been using for a little while now. It's pretty quick. Of course, um, nothing will beat last year's methods with like the super, super quick AFK farm stuff. Um, I'm trying to find something really efficient, but I think this is possibly one of the fastest routes we could get. Um, I'm also noticing that those move really slow for some reason, but by the time they're here, they're kind of coming at a rapid pace still, so it doesn't really matter. It's just how fast they're getting there is the issue, um, but in the end, it doesn't matter because their drop rate is still the same, and there's still that same distance between their drops, so technically the speed it moves on the conveyors does not matter, so like cannons and stuff wouldn't do anything. It's just gonna get there quicker. You'd have to wait a couple seconds less is all. Um, when you first like join in or something. But yeah, this is much, much more worth it than you think. It's super quick. Um Yeah. It's just a slightly improved version of uh last week's, but I hope you enjoyed. Um thanks for coming by. Appreciate it.